Shoebox Volunteers. This is uh, Mental Health Awareness Month, May 2024. And the theme for this month is Compassion Connects. And I want to thank each of you, literally and figuratively, as you can see here, how much Shoebox and your work and these boxes have meant to me over the last five years. It's been five years. I'll try to be really brief. I lost everything due to my entrepreneurial losses. And I was in, in 2019, I accessed the crisis room at Margaret's. And my birthday is March 11th. And I, my first day there was March 1st. So the staff at Margaret's gave me a box, a random box and said, for my birthday, I guess it was an extra box, a shoe box. I didn't know anything about shoe box at the time. That time was such a, a bleak mental health time for me that when I went to Margaret's, I decided I'm either going to end everything right here, and I mean that literally, or I'm going to make something of my journey. And your box that day on my birthday helped me so much to, to come to today. Um, I mean, if you, this is just, I, I picked up a random box, look at this. You're doing great. Focus on the good. You matter. Keep going. You've got this. Uh, you can do this. And then this is the type of joy that you find inside every single box. So I want to thank all your work, the winters, fundraising, getting everything together, the staff, working together. Thank you so much. So this is my little gift to you all. Um, as I said, in honor of Mental Health Day and everything that you've done for me, but take me a like little nothing me kind of thing over I don't know how many hundreds of thousands, I don't know how many women over the years you have helped out of depression, out of dark times with a little bit of joy that perhaps seems like a little bit, it's like a little box, but when you're on the receiving end of it, it's not a little bit, it's a huge bit. So thank you, and then I need to say thank you to Kelly, who, my GT, GT, uh, GTA East coordinator that I met, and she asked me a couple of years ago to do some videos um, for, uh, for Shoebox, sorry, I'm emotional now, and then Karen asked me to speak at the volunteer appreciation event earlier this year. I'm so grateful, and my, Today, this is what I want to give back, but down the road, just last week, I started um, an enterprise, a social enterprise called Resilient Inc. And long story, but it's a new kind of venture capital funding program that I want to put together that gives back of every single uh, lived experience founders company, 33% from day one of stock to different organizations. Shoebox Project is the first one I hope that I'll be considered to give back to. So I thank you and I don't know if it's appropriate to say have a wonderful mental health day, week, but enjoy this week and be, be proud of your journey, whatever it is, because we all, we're all part of life and lived experience is a part of all of us and there's nothing to be ashamed of if you have a mental health journey. So Shoebox Project, thank you. And very, very quick thank you. I always say thanks those, those sisters-in-law that launched this all years ago. I don't know how many. Thank you, because without you guys putting together things in the shoebox and in your community, none of, none, none of us would have benefited the way we have. So thank you.